Hello everybody and welcome to Wine Library TV. I am your host, me, Gary Vay, Nur, Chuck, and this, my friends, is The Thunder Show, AKA the internet's most passionate wine program. And we are here today tasting some wine. We're doing a very interesting week of shows. We are tasting wines out of brown paper bags Kay Murph, Kristen Murphy, you might have seen her on the floor. All I know is reason. I don't know country, I don't know vintage, I don't know price. I don't know jack crap other than it's a Riesling. And so we're gonna review it, unveil it, have a little bit of fun fun. Right, Brandon? Once again, Brandon running away. Right. Let's give us a sniffy sniff. So on the nose, you definitely get a little bit of like a cantaloupe melon thing coming across right away. A little clove action. A little bit of citrus play as well. You know, would have definitely guessed Riesling on the nose. I think, maybe converts, believe it or not, because there's a little hint of lychee on the back end that might have swayed me that way. Let's give it a whirl. Nice acid balance. A um, little more sugar than I would have liked, which makes me think it's not Alsatian. Um, but good ripe fruit, very sweet, like peach flavors on the back end, which I liked. Good solid stuff, probably a $20, $25 Riesling is probably what it's worth. Um, if, if this unveiled at, let's say, 18 to 24, that would be the price range that I'd pay for this. I like the structure. It's a little sugar fine in the back end, uh, which almost makes me think my price point's a little high. Um, but all in all, it's acidity on the back end is very ripe and kind of like a sour apple flavor that I enjoy quite a bit. Petroly fruit's pretty good. Let's unveil this. Ah, ah, 88 plus points. Reiner Weiss. 2007, Riesling, 91 points, David Shellneck, and this is 28 US dollars, dry wine from Austria, and uh, I like it, Reiner Weiss, just a hair fruity for me, 91 Shellneck, I went 88, um, I was a little bit more in line price point wines originally, uh, did go a little bit lower, so based on all that, this wine is a pass. If you really see how we're doing it here, Mott, we structure it. It's a very intriguing kind of way to do it. Uh, Reiner Weiss is a great producer. Uh, Shellneck's an amazing um, uh, reviewer. And uh, all in all, it was a quality effort, um, but I thought it was just a, a hair overrated. And that's it. That's how we're gonna do them. Tight, you know, you're in and out. It's the internet age. You don't need these seven hour epic wine library TVs. Um, let's try to refine this a little bit. Question of the day. What do you like to put in brown paper bags? You, me, wine world changed.